right guys, so welcome to this week's video. So today we're doing things a little bit different. Uh, tomorrow morning is the ruck, and in preparation for that the night before I normally rest, but I already had a rest day this week, so I'm gonna go link up with Corey. We're gonna knock out some shoulders, some brutal shoulders, I can't wait for that. Um, then gonna carb load, get ready for tomorrow's 12 miler. Uh, my goal tomorrow, I wanna try, you know, I've been out of the military now for, gosh, quite some time. I don't even know how many years, seven years. But um, the, the mark that I always hit for in rucking was aerosol pace. Like you had to hit, finish 12 miles. If you're going to do it, you got to come in under three hours. And I would always shoot for well under three hours, right? Um, but if I, if I can hit under three hours, I'd be, you know, I'm pushing, I'm getting up close to 50. God damn, I'm, a, I'm an old man. So, uh, yeah, if I can knock out three hours, 12 mile ruck, uh, I'm gonna be happy with that. You know, all of this, we continue our prep for the 100 mile ruck march. More info coming about that shortly. Um, you know, we're gonna be raising money for Mission 22 to help fight veteran suicide. So stoked about that. Also, we got great news. So coming up next week, I've just, I think we just re received our first shipment, but we finally got our blueberry cobbler protein in. Mm. And I'll tell you what, I was sampling some of it the other night. It's better, in my opinion, than when we threw it in research and development and tested it. Uh, I mean, it's an amazing protein. It's gonna be a huge launch for UXO. This protein formula actually has an inclusion of little bits of blueberries and protein bars in it to give it a nice texture. So it actually feels like you're consuming something as you take it in. And uh, I'll tell you what, it's it's money. It's a game changer for our protein business. It is a limited edition formula. So once they're gone, they're gone. So jump on that bandwagon quick. But anyways, uh, I digress. I'm gonna hit up Corey and Berserker, destroy some shoulders for you people, and then we out. So like I said, tomorrow we got another ruck ahead of us. So we're focusing on strength training. Came in, did a little bit of light cardio here at Berserker, Corey. And then uh, we're going heavy, real heavy on shoulders. That's been one of the key things I'm trying to balance is like, okay, we're doing all this cardio, we're doing all this endurance training, prepping for the 100 mile ruck. You know, when we hit the gym, working different variations of movements. So some days I'll be going, you know, more, more reps. Um, and then other days like today, I'm just gonna go for just pure strength, right? Keep my size on while we're doing all the extra endurance. We're gonna have shoulders, me and Corey. Let's get after it. post-workout by the time this video is released I'm sure that this is gonna be out but we got the brand new post ISO it's blueberry cobbler 
and this stuff is absolutely amazing, guys. So this is your post-workout. Since it's an isolate, obviously it's gonna digest very, very fast, and that's what you want post-workout. You wanna be able to get the protein into your body, fuel your muscles, keep your body in an anabolic state longer. You got your 30 minute window, but check this out. Here's what I love about this limited edition blueberry cobbler. So in each scoop, we actually put in inclusions, right? So I don't know if you can see it, but each scoop has real chunks or small bits of blueberry and protein bar in it, which, I mean, it may sound a little bit crazy, but it adds nice texture to it. So my biggest thing, when I get it done at the gym and I pound an isolate, which is normally watered down, it doesn't make me feel full. Like, yeah, I'm fueling my body, but I'm still hungry. Adding that little bit of texture in there makes it a little bit thicker. You got something to crunch on. So let me tell you, it actually feels like you're putting something in your body. It's a, you know, a whole mental thing. But on top of that, the flavor in this thing, absolutely amazing. Absolutely bananas. No, it's not. It's blueberry cobbler, bitch. So, cheers. Is it that bad? Look inside that thing. <laughs> it's bad? It's so bad. <laughs> and this right here, this shit you see on the walk, like that's a full size person hanging from a tree. First time we rucked down by here, when I came across that, it scared the shit out of me. I thought it was a person like jumping out of the fucking tree at me. Just someone who wants to have a skier, I guess, hanging from the tree in the backyard. Shit you see in Boise, man. I'll tell you what. So we're at the half mile point. Goal today was to hit 12 miles. Right now we're six miles in. Now we're 40, which puts us about 10 mile, 10 minutes over air assault pace, which is decent for how long we've been out of the military. Today, good rock. Beautiful view as usual, right? So the goal with us completing 12 miles today, next week we'll bump it up to 16. Um, after 16, we'll bump it up to 20. We're gonna focus on speed too. Like, I do wanna be able to get under an aerosol pace, but gotta make sure the feet can maintain hitting 100 miles in three days. We still don't know what that's gonna look like, so. Fun times, right John? Absolutely. Completed it 12 miles down, lost a little bit of speed. Completed it three hours, 23 minutes. Decent time, decent pace. Carrie, she went with. How was it, babe, first time? I'm really hungry. Yeah, definitely hungry. It's definitely time to eat some food. Next week, we're stepping up to 16 miles. Getting our legs prepped, baby. Okay, perfect. How was it, dude? It was good today. Man, the weather's okay. nice. Beautiful the man. consistency, that pace, trying to keep up with you, it was really good. Um, but I think we got a lot of work to do, because 30 miles every day for three days, it's, you know, it's gonna be a lot of work, but we got this. Tonight, we are doing flank steak, putting on some dry rub from feast mode. This is Tennessee whiskey. It's probably one of my favorite flavors for them. You really need to check them out. Like, their stuff's legit. Low sodium, no MSGs, gluten-free. Amazing for all types of food. They have so many flavors too, which when I see these guys at the shows we do, I stock up, you know? But great prices for it too. The seasoning is not that bad. What I love about flank steak, steak's so thin, you just slice it up when it's ready, serve it, you're good to go. But if you have a Traeger, Kick that bad boy up to 450, throw the flank steak on there. You can have a meal ready in 15 minutes. Nice and medium rare. Perfect, going bueno. on. Mm. Look at that. 
That is perfect. Dinner is served as soon as I cut it all.